ready to fight. Ready. All right, here we are in the Brick City, Newark, New Jersey, inside Prudential Center. I can think of a lot of fighters that have had big moments inside these walls. Colby Covington, Anthony Rumble Johnson with a big knockout back in the day. We'll see who shines in front of this capacity crowd tonight. This is a great arena, but my memory goes to the one time that a guy at the barbershop tried to give me a hairline. He painted me a full-on black hairline. I said, you know what, I can't go to the arena looking like this. I can't show up for fights looking like I'm 17 years old. So I washed it off and went and watched some fantastic fights. That's a true story, by it's the way. It's a Bob real story. Trying to call those boos and boos. Trying to boos and boos. It was picture day for DC. Trading good shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Oh, Superman punches Drew. Head kick attempt. It's blocked. Just over three minutes to go round one. Oh, massive kick lands flush. Nice entry on the takedown there from Cain Velazquez, and not unlike his teammate, Khabib Nurmagomedov, when Velazquez gets in on you, it is very hard to prevent the takedown. Well, he's worked very hard on this part of his game, and these ground strikes are really starting to take their toll. Another ground and pound strike lands. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. You can't take all those unanswered strikes. They don't have to be that damaging. Yeah. You just got to move. Under two minutes to go. Nice transition. Oh, high-level stuff here with the ground and pound by Cain Velasquez. Really doing a nice job getting these shots home on the ground. Velasquez is in half goal. Side control now, DC. A lot of options at his disposal from here. Under a minute to go. Oh, nice ground and pound elbow to the dome. Oh, back to the well with that elbow. That one landed well. Well, working pretty effectively from the top here. Nice ground and pound by Velasquez. He let him step over to the crucifix. Final seconds here. Round two straight ahead. Stop, stop, stop. You won that last round. He was all over you. You did better than that. Come on now. Let's shake it out. Let's get back in there. Let's get back to the game plan. Hands high. Work behind the gym. All right, well, the crowd enjoyed those five minutes. DC, take us through some of the highlights from that previous round. Face punching at its best. Ha. He loaded. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, round two. Effective jab there by King Velasquez. Oh, big right hook, but a whiff. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Real sneaky body kick. Another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Well, the body work starting to take its toll. Look at the redness starting to appear on his left side. Oh, that'll send your head sideways. Vicious uppercut. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Just over. Oh, nice double leg, yes. Velasquez is in half guard. Continuing to work. Out of the half guard. Oh, oh, oh. 
right, so he continues to land, and not exactly what we thought we would see in this one tonight, but the rest were willing to stand and trade and proving to be able as well. Yeah, it's out of the ordinary. Usually this guy level changes to take you down very early in fights, but tonight he is showing that he is comfortable in the striking, and he is on point with his striking. They've worked very hard to improve his stand-up skills, and it's showing right now. Nice straight punch there. He's got to throw that kick behind those punches. Velazquez's cheek looks like it's cut here, starting to win a little bit now. Trying to guard pass here, not today. No, it ain't happening. Good job understanding the transition. Good work from the top here by Velasquez. These ground strikes really started to add up. There's another one. Just gotta be careful here. Going for that patented rear naked choke now. Oh, that rear naked choke looks tight. Oh, so how about that? The offensive fighter bails on the submission now. Very smart. You gotta keep position over submission. Mm, that was nice. Posture's up now and lands a devastating strike to the head. Final seconds here. Round three next. Stop. All right, so the round is over. You see, obviously, the fighter has a cut on his cheek sustained in that round, but better to be below the eye than above it. The cut man is in there trying to close it up. Go out there with the mindset that you need to take this round and win this fight. All right, back to the stools we go, and it's starting to look like a second mouth on his cheek. <laughs> Yeah, it looks terrible. I mean, the guy is getting hit with big shots. One big enough to open up a nasty cut on his cheek. While it's in a better spot, it still is very difficult to deal with. Like, if he absorbs another strike on that cheek, he might actually be able to eat through that cut <laughs> on his cheek. You ready to fight? I'm just saying. He's got you a ready? big mouth. <laughs> Here we go. Five minutes remain in the fight. Oh, he continues to attack the body yet again here, just as he did in the previous round. Clean punch. Now a takedown attempt. It is not there, and not a tumble either. The last kiss is I now closing up. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Look at the skip action that allows you to land that big key. Oh, nice right hand. Great job moving into his opponent and getting to that single collar tie. Oh, beautiful jab there by Kane Velasquez. Both fighters throwing heat now. So some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to, start to add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack. Not being one-dimensional, not headhunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now, and it's starting to show itself. All right, very late in the fight now, DC. I know we don't have open scoring, but correct me if I'm wrong, he needs a submission or he's losing this fight. He is not a big puncher, so he needs to get this fight to the crowd. He blocked that one. When both are prepared. Ooh. Another one. Gets back to his feet. Oh, big right hook there. Shot a double leg. Oh, he slams his opponent to the canvas. I think the octagon is shaking. DC. The octagon was shaking. Somebody secure the doors <laughs> because they are going to blow the roof off of this place. Oh, another beautiful body shot there. You see the damage starting to accumulate. Maybe some defense would be wise at this point in the fight. I think so, John. You can't just get beat up to the body. It doesn't show itself right away. It takes time whenever you're beating somebody up from the body and working your way up to the head. But right now, we're starting to see the damage, and you see it not only in the body, but in the reaction of the opponent. Oh, hard ground and pound strike there. I believe that one opened him up. 
Nice positional control here. So the fighter's able to reverse position on the ground, and now he's got the dominant position. Yeah, what a great job recognizing that once he got the reversal, he went right to his offense. He didn't wait, John. He did a good job of while his opponent goes, oh my goodness, I lost the position. He said, no, no, we're not done. I'm gonna get to a dominant position myself. Vasquez is pretty swollen now in that jaw area. It doesn't appear to be affecting him all that much, but he's absorbed a lot of strikes to the head. Got to figure out a way to raise the guard and be more defensively sound. We'll see how the judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score this contest 30-27, 9-28, 29-28, for the winner by unanimous decision, White! All right, so the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was an easy fight to score. Whereas his opponent had a few moments, he was the one that truly did lead all the interactions. He's the person that truly did dictate if the fight was standing or on the ground.